Hoiberg and Hackler. Thomas Bragg for Brandau, the national leader in points and assists per game, takes his first shot and Well, ask Yale with, with that Penn State game, you really, you just can't let up, you can't let off the gas. Spinning inside and a goal for Penn. That is Griffin Skane, who has been... Good little work of the two-man game to create that separation. Chris Kinnett can't get his hands free. Walsh, defended by Pisano. Good feed in front, but Paquette the save on to... 6.20 to go, first quarter. Krevsky takes a bump. Good pass. Anderson shot was blocked right back to him, and he missed. Flies. Johnny Kibe, the junior, finds a man. Cool, whips it. Carroll the save, but we'll get the call. Uh, challenge other teams in what they want to do. James Shipley cuts back, finds room, and scores. James ties the game at two. Hackler. Hackler and Solberg have the two goals for Yale today. Brandau finds a man, and Solberg misses high. In the other restraining line. Bragg has 10 points over his last four games, including seven goals. Brandau, great find for Johnny Kaib, and he puts Yale back ahead. Flag and this is Matt Brandau, gets all the attention, two guys slide to him, and they leave Kaib right open on the crease. 90 seconds to play in the opening quarter. Matt Brandau gets the screen, finds Anderson, and he scores! David Anderson has just such You see the ball movement, he's going opposite direction of the ball movement. And just... Carson Cool. Cool still with it, missed the net wide. Brand wins against ranked teams, Duke, Delaware, and most recently Cornell last Saturday. Casey Mulligan, and he is serving penalty. Here's Pat Pisano, net's empty for a moment. Still Pisano, all the way to the net and a whistle. And it's all, shot clock is back down to 20. Walsh, good feet across. Hoffman back to the top. Time running low on Penn. They find room though and find a goal. Shifty James Shifley, just he is leaving guys on their feet. Christian Johnson just loses his footing right there but just such a beautiful split from saying we're not going to stop him but if he has two goals and two assists instead of three goals and three assists we consider that a win today carroll a big save on krebsky and now here's chris Kinnett. Kinnett knifes his way in and a save by jared pock is off of their line not letting him go where they want to and forcing Yale very deep in the shot clock again. Kai finds Brandau, it's off his stick. I, I wouldn't be as surprised to see a, a replay on that. that. That was really close. Back to even strength. And Penn makes it not matter as Kumar ties the game. So this is the initial shot that hit off the crossbar and looked pretty close to going in. No. Really just wants to keep that close and they've done that so far. Six out of 10 is the Yale advantage. Good pass, and another one. Benz for the first time today. And the Quakers have come back from two down and gone ahead five to four. Jerry, you, you saw Chris Arceri actually had, Penn won the face-off battle last year. Cole Cashy and whips it wide. Trying to find room and he's right into a double team again. Just swarming defense from the Quakers. Krebsky bounces it and scores! How did that go? Max Krebsky, just such Older. a physical dodger. This view will give us a little bit better angle of it. Nice bounce shot, Carroll's down, and that ball is top shelf. All trying to go back ahead in this top 12 matchup. Matt Brandau comes top side and scores! And the Bulldogs are back ahead. And, and they were a little bit flat. That defense was really doing a great job. And then Brandau, kind of that. Penn has to go here. Danola 
bounces it. Good save by Jared Paquette, and he brings it. This Yale offense doing a good job of winning the individual matchups. And Brandau <laughs> wins that one. National leader in scoring. Just that one-on-one -on -one matchup, he's able to create that separation and get his hand goalie at Syracuse. Nice catch there by Skane. Comes for Ruben, who hasn't done much yet today. Missed with his shot. Walsh. Good defense there from Oaken. Mulligan with eight seconds. Walsh in front, missed the net. It is Carson Cool, full head of steam. Top side, shoots off the post. Rebound score! How did... Max Krevsky, great off Probably ball, just smart play, cuts the back door, and is there as it comes off of the five when Yale plays at Nickerson Field against BU Tuesday night. Here is James Shipley, the only Penn player with two goals in the first half, and Ruben gets on the board. Right. Cam Ruben with a beautiful shot. Great job shot. by Shipley to draw that attention. A little hitch, and then right over his shoulder. Back to him, though. Shot clock reset to 60. Mulligan feeds it in front. Danola, and it hit off Paquette again. Beat that matchup. Long stick back on him on a switch. Cool, top side, missed. Turnovers, 19 of them between the two teams today. Brandau picks it up, open net, trying to find a man, and Anderson tried to get a shot through. And then you're not being able to capitalize on it. You're right where you started, and, and Penn is right in this game. There's Peter Moynihan, finds a little bit of room, and scores! What a move, man. And Yale's back up by three. And Moynihan restores the three-goal lead. Goals for Skane, Ruben, Smith, and Kumar in this game for Penn. Here is Shipley moving in. Gets around Molly in a save pocket. Solberg lost his footing again. Anderson saved by Emmett Lute Howitzer of a shot. See if he unleashes one. Walsh up top. Gets it back. Ruben shoots and scores. Wants it. It's gonna get that defense rotating. Move it, move it. And Ruben just gets a second and just Moynihan has Yell's last goal. Cool swings it for Bragg. Brandau in front. A lot of room and he scores. And Matt Brandau has career scoring record. Third of the day for Brandau. Five more points in. Another first year player for Penn in the game. Number 38. Here's Kanal Kumar. Hands free and he missed the net. So Hackler restarts it. Throws it in front. Quick catch by Brandau, but Carroll got a piece as it was at halftime. Next couple goals in this game are obviously going to mean everything. Johnny Kybe with the ball. Whips it, didn't get much on it, and first shot ends up giving it up. Shipley just creating that space. Low Ooh. shot and pocket. Lost his balance, but back to his feet. Cash in again, top side, and he scores. Cole Cash in, fired up, looks out at the crowd, entertained, but a great jump shot turning. L has nearly led wire to wire. Carson Cool puts the Jets on, finds Anderson, and he scores. Largest lead. Carson Cool draws a slide. And David Anderson just fills in the little space there. Four, and it lasted for one minute and three seconds. Clean win on the faceoff. Penn going quickly. And they score. Luke Danola with a huge one for the Quakers. Won it clean, won it clean created the fast break, and moved the ball. That's exactly what you want to see. And, and our Penn not giving Brandau an inch. They're not going to let him catch a ball cleanly. Here he is, gives it up. 
Bragg comes to the top and his shot mid. Here's Thomas Bragg now. Finds a little bit of room and Carroll makes a big save today. Came into the game number one in the country in points per game at six and a half. Gets it here. Oh my goodness. Respond now and, and use that momentum and chip one away here. Good pass on the outlet by Carroll. Long stick has it and scores. Tyler career goal. And it's 12 to nine. And it's goalie to long stick to get Penn with in three. Gain. Shipley. Little bit of room, but he missed the net with 20 seconds to shoot. It's Brandau for Bragg. Now cool. Brandau up top. Finds Anderson and a save by Carroll. 20 seconds. Griffin Skane. No room for him to operate. Quick shot off the crossbar. Or final. Yale defeats the Penn Quakers at home. Things didn't go their way. They responded. They didn't have the faceoff day they're used to. It's a, a big win for them against a very tough Penn team. The Bulldogs go to 7-2 and, and could create...